All right, let's get a bit more on that story now. We speak to our contributing editor at the SABC, Vuyo Mvoko. He's going to unpack the ANC list for us. Vuyo, a very good morning to you. It's uh, quite a controversial one, some might say. Uh, some rather interesting names included. Talk us through that. Well, lots of things to read into it indeed because, I mean, if you look at the likes of Dinapule, Andile Lungisa, Pulemade, one would uh, wonder whether, in fact, the ANC is serious about dealing with um, um, corruption because these people, I mean, have in many ways been implicated in uh, all sorts of um, allegations of corruption and so on. So some people may read it to that, that uh, as long as you are in the right faction, um, you don't have to worry about everything else. But I think uh, it also contains quite a lot of surprises, and there's quite a lot of things um, to read into it. For example, I think it does give us a sense of people to watch. You know, I mean, if you look at people like Zizi Kodo, who are topping the list, if uh, you uh, look at people like Togo, Didiza, people like Tombowini, people like um, um, Zueli Veli, Le Mandela, um, Balek Ambete's inclusion, what does it mean, you know, because you cannot, um, from where I sit, uh, give her a, 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 a far less important um, portfolio or seat or job to do. So it does uh, perhaps give us a sense of who's going to be in cabinet and who are going to be ministers and deputy ministers uh, uh, and some new names there. Of course, uh, there are uh, notable omissions, uh, Manuel um, among them. Uh, but, I mean, he has been open about the fact that, in fact, uh, maybe one should say he's been a reluctant participant of late, um, giving, I think, the clearest indications, him together with uh, Deputy President Khalima Mutante, that they are no longer keen um, to serve um, any other term. But also, I think there is a, one can read a rewarding, if you like names um, that will raise some eyebrows, people like uh, Leonard Matakana from COPE, Julie Killian from COPE, it, it, it I think gives a sense of um, uh, the ANC rewarding those who are prepared to sort of break the back of what the ANC considers to be um, opposition to it, like uh, COPE. It does seem like a, quite a forgiving list, Vuyo. Uh, you've mentioned some names. Uh, one name that comes to mind, the AU chair, Nkosa Zanadamini Zuma. Uh, we believe she's at the bottom of the list. Is there anything that we can read into that? Look, I mean, she too has been a bit of a, shall we say, a, 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 a reluctant um, person because, I mean, if you, if you followed her most recent comments, she said she is prepared to stay on and serve her term as the AU chair, which then suggests that she's not so keen um, uh, to do this. Um, but on the other hand, as uh, I'm sure people who follow AU processes closely will know, she he is having some serious problems, you know. Is she going to dump that sheep and, 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 and go to Parliament or is she going to stay the course? And, uh, and, and everything that goes with that, of course, it's, uh, that will remain a, a, a moot point. But, I mean, if you look at people like Sonwabile Mangodwa, I mean, out of the blue from the National Heritage Council, I mean, what um, is the ANC trying to do or what is he up to? So so there's, there's quite a lot, really, really, to read. I mean, Fiki Lembalula, as everyone knows, uh, I mean, was opposed to President Jacob Zuma, but uh, he's up there. He's a favorite, number six. You know, what's going on? In Jimucheka, a lot of people have raised all manner of uh, problems um, with her, but she remains popular. We need Matigizela Mandela. I mean, she is back, you know, um, and she is no, she's a known sort of a Julius Malema confidant and mm -hmm. so is Mbalula to an extent. Mm -hmm. So it's, a, it's, a, it, it's probably the best mix you could get where the ANC is trying to make sure that um, those who are, are outside don't, I mean, people who are seen to be outside don't, you know, sort of mess things up, but also mm -hmm. making sure that those who are popular inside do get rewarded, but also those who are dealing with the enemies in all 
uh, sorts of ways are also rewarded. Indeed. Uh, I mean, the uh, we, generational we, I'm mix. To, I think I'm going to interrupt. I think so I was going to say to that the generational mix, especially when you spoke on uh, Minister Figile Mbalula, as well as uh, Malusi Kikaba, uh, two words that spring to mind whenever we hear those names uh, included in that list is generational mix. Now, that was Voyom Vogo, our contributing editor here at the SABC. We'll hear a lot more from him as we build up to the May 7th elections. Well,